I've spoken with other Linwood High School students. Some say they've been in this U.S. history teachers class and they say they're surprised. This teacher seems to be popular around here. Some students tell me that at the start of the year he warned students he does not tolerate fighting in his room. But some say what you're about to watch may have been crossing the line. This video shows a Linwood High School teacher putting a sophomore in what the student calls a chokehold. The 10th grader seen here is Andrew Boyd. I'm just I'm over here tapping out and he's like like putting like really hard aggressive gestures and like it's like it's a really tight lock and I'm tapping out I'm just seeing like little pixels and stuff everywhere. After asking several times what sounds like are you calm? Are you calm? The teacher lets go. Boyd says a verbal argument with threats from another student but no physical contact between the two turned into this situation last Thursday. The sophomore says he has asked multiple times to be separated from this student. Requesting for me to be removed from the classroom or for him to be removed from the classroom and there was nothing done about the situation. The young man's mother says she knew nothing about the incident when she picked up her sons from school that day. I picked my baby up at three o'clock and no one ever informed me. He didn't say anything because he was afraid that I would react. But the video recorded by another student made its way onto social media and into mom's hands. These are photos Boyd says shows the bruising left around his neck. The family's attorney says it may be enough for criminal charges against the history teacher. For the rest of us, if we're placing a chokehold, it's at least an assault and battery. In a statement, the Linwood Unified School District says the teacher is on administrative leave while the district works with law enforcement in their investigation. Boyd says he just wants life to return to normal without having to be in the same room as this teacher. Mom wants to be at peace when she drops her boys off at school. I want to know that my kids are safe. When I take them to and from school, when I put you in the gate, that's your job to protect them. They weren't protecting and he wasn't giving what's owed to him. The LA County Sheriff's Department says this investigation is in the preliminary stages and investigators ask anyone with more videos of this incident to contact detectives immediately. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.